Perimeter is the distance of any figure covered around its edges. So, it is basically the boundary of any figure. Thus, perimeter is the sum of all the sides of a given figure. Perimeter is measured using units. In this chapter, we will also learn about surface area and volume of solids such as cube, cuboids and cylinders. In this chapter, we will study the following concepts. Perimeter and area of plane figure area of some more figures, surface area and volume of solids. Perimeter of rectangle Consider a rectangle ABCD with length AB equal to CD equal to L and breadth BC equal to DA equal to B. Perimeter of a rectangle is equal to sum of all its sides. It implies perimeter P is equal to L plus B plus L plus B which is equal to 2 into L plus B. This implies perimeter of a rectangle is twice of the sum of length and breadth. Regular polygons. Polygons which have equal sides are known as regular polygons like equilateral triangle, square, etc. Perimeter of any regular polygon is equal to number of sides into length of side. So we have perimeter of a square is equal to 4 into side. Perimeter of an equilateral triangle is 3 into side. Perimeter of a regular pentagon is 5 into side and so on. Perimeter of any figure is the sum of all its sides. Perimeter of a circle. The perimeter of a circle is known as its circumference. Taking a circle with center O, radius R and circumference C, we have C is equal to 2 pi R where pi is equal to 22 divided by 7 or 3.14. So, circumference of a semicircle is half of the circumference of circle which is equal to pi r. Perimeter of a square. Square is a rectangle whose length and breadth are equal. Therefore, formula used to obtain the perimeter of a rectangle is applicable to obtain the perimeter of a square. Perimeter is equal to AB plus BC plus CD plus DA which is equal to 4 into side. One side of a square is equal to perimeter of a square divided by 4. In this example, we will find the perimeter of a square whose side is of length 5 centimeters. Solution. As perimeter of a square is equal to 4 into side, then the perimeter is 20 centimeters. Area. Area is that part of the plane which is occupied by a closed figure. A closed figure can be of different regular and irregular shapes. Also, area is measured using square units. The usual unit is square meter. Area of rectangle. Consider a rectangle ABCD with length AB is equal to CD is equal to L and breadth BC is equal to DA is equal to B then the area of rectangle is equal to length into breadth. Then L is equal to A upon B and B is equal to A upon L. Area of square. Square is a rectangle with all sides equal. That is, length is equal to breadth. So, the area of square is equal to side into side. That is, A is equal to side square. Therefore, side is equal to square root of area. Area of a triangle. Consider ABC with its height H is AD. Then, area of triangle ABC is equal to half of B into H, where B is the base, BC, and H is the height, AD. Also, base B is equal to twice of area divided by height, H, and height H is equal to twice of area divided by base B. Area of a parallelogram. Consider a parallelogram PQRS with base B is equal to side SR and height H which is side PT. Area of a parallelogram PQRS is equal to B into H. Also, base B is equal to area divided by height and height H is equal to area divided by base B. Area of a circle. Consider a circle with center O and radius R is equal to OA. Then, area of circle is equal to pi r square. 
where pi is equal to 22 divided by 7 or 3.14. Also, area of semicircle is equal to half of pi r square. Conversion in area. The common units of area and their relations are given here. 